Have you just stepped into the world of coding and find it challenging to write codes or summarize those codes? Well, worry no more because Sourcegraph has introduced a new AI assistant or you can say your personal coding assistant which will write, summarize and execute the codes for you and you don't have to do anything. Moreover, this assistant is totally free but for personal use only. And today we'll talk about Kodi and how does it function. And moreover, I'll show you how this assistant is better than other assistant like Copilot. So be with me throughout this video. And before we move forward, I would like to tell you that P10X has an exclusive AI tool workshop. Do check it out. Link is in the description. Hey Aditya, I'm working in this office since the last five years and you just recently joined and you have a salary five times as me. How is that possible, man? It is because I'm using AI tools and chat GPT to automate my work and I'm working 10 times as compared to you. That's why I'm getting paid five times as compared to you. That is super, man. Can you please teach me the same so that I can grow my salary as well? Absolutely, I can. Now, to start off, what you have to do is you have to go to Cody's website and there you'll see three options. Log in with GitHub, log in with GitLabs, and log in with Google. You may go with anyone you want, but I'm gonna go with GitHub. And then you'll see an interface where it's gonna tell you how you can access Kodi extinction on different platforms like VS Code, Intel IJ. I'm gonna go with VS Code. Then you just have to install it and sign in with GitHub and then authorize it. Now you finally have the Kodi installed successfully. Now Kodi provides you multiple features like chat with Kodi, documents, edit code with Kodi, explain codes, smell, test, and you can even create your own custom commands. Now Kodi also provides you different AI modules like Cloud 2.0, Cloud 2.1, Cloud Instant, and even ChatGPT 3.5 Turbo and ChatGPT 4 Turbo, though it's in preview. Now, I'm gonna ask Cody a simple question. Explain this report to me and then let's see what happens. Now, Cody gave me answer to this query in keywords. Obviously, to save my time and make it easier for me to understand. Now, let's create an app with the help of Cody. To make an app, I need to decide what type of app I need. So, I have decided I'm gonna go with a fantasy type app with some fantasy things like quests and all that stuff. So, I have given the command to Cody to make me an app named Epic DO. I commanded Cody with its features and basic terms. Now, let's see what it does. So, right, it gave me the answer again in key points just to manage my time and make it easier for me to understand. It is also guiding me how I can create this app. It told me I need a home page, a dashboard, a quest details a profile section and many more things. Now let's ask Cody to help us code this whole app. So I've given the prompt, help me implement the changes to add the red app slash page dot TSX. And it has automatically generated me a code. And you know what the best part is? You can again ask Cody to generate you more codes and with the help of Cody, you can actually make this whole app. Now this was how you can ask Cody to help you develop your app but the question is, how is this extinction better than the whole Microsoft Copilot? Now, before I answer you that, I would like to warn you with something. See, AI is taking over the world. In such a short span of time, we have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs being replaced by AI and whatnot. And you don't want to get affected by this recessive wave, right? Well, AI won't replace you. The people using AI will. If you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our three hours of AI tool workshop in which we will teach you about the best AI tools to upscale, increase your productivity and enhance your career. Make your future secure with us. Join our workshop by clicking the link below in the description. Now, the basic and the most important difference between Kodi and Copilot is Kodi knows your code base and Copilot doesn't. And this creates a big difference as Kodi can recommend you with more codes from your code base, but Copilot cannot do that. And this is why Kodi is said to be better now, there are some more additional features that Kodi has but Copilot doesn't. These features are rather small but creates a big difference. The first is custom commands in Kodi. Now, Kodi has some pre-installed commands like edit, smell, documents, chat with Kodi and many more. But you can even add a custom command which helps the user with better experience and helps the user to develop rapidly. The second feature is access to multiple AI modules. So basically, Copilot is fully owned by Microsoft. And it does not allow us to access multiple AI modules like ChatGPT and Cloud. But in case of Kodi, we can access multiple AI modules just like Cloud and ChatGPT, which again enhances the user satisfaction and is better, right? The third thing is Kodi also allows us to select different LLM models, which is also large language models. And that's so from vendors, but Copilot doesn't. 
But personally, what I think is both of the tools are good at their respective pleasures. As Copilot also provides with many more things that Kodi does not. It's just the way you use these AI tools. Let's not compare them. Now tell me in the comment section, have you ever used Kodi? And if you did, what are the things you developed with the help of Kodi? And also like the video, subscribe to the channel and share this video among your friends and do check out our AI tool workshop. Believe me, it's a pond full of knowledge. You just have to dive in it. We'll see you there. Thank you.